My name is Jason Hill. I'm an OpsWAD SC. Today I will be showing you how to integrate your MetaDefender iCap into your Nutanix SMB file shares. By connecting your Nutanix SMB shares to your iCap server, you're going to be able to determine the efficacy of the files that traverse your SMB shares. In order to do that, what we'll do is we'll go from home up to file servers. Inside of here, you will have your file servers presented to you. You may have multiple, in which case you'll need to add the ICAP server to those different ones. But for purposes of this demonstration, we have the one file server. Once you click on it, you have the option here for antivirus settings. You'll click on this, and this will pop up a page where you connect your ICAP server to your Nutanix file shares. Place the name in or the IP address of the server that you'll be wanting, as well as the description of it, and then click on save. At this point here, it will go ahead and submit those operations for that to be added, and then test files will start to be sent to the ICAP server, and you'll see your connection status go to OK. In the event that it doesn't, you'll want to make sure that port 1344 or the port you've chosen for your ICAP server is open on that server. Once you're finished, click Next, and you will be presented with the scan settings. Your scan settings are scan on write or scan on read. It is suggested that you have both of those enabled, but please note Nutanix is letting you know that they do not do ICAP via NFS or exports or the clients, so only for SMB for the time being. Once you're finished, click on Save. At this point, you have added ICAP to your file server. You now need to apply that ICAP to the SMB share itself. Click on Share Export, click on the SMB share that you will be wanting this on, go to Antivirus Settings, and enable antivirus settings for that particular share. And once again, Nutanix lets you know that they do not do this for NFS, just for SMB. Once again, the recommendation is it's scanning on write and scanning on read. From there, hit save. And you have now enabled the integration between MetaDefender iCap and your Nutanix file shares. To see that it is working, you can come up to your iCap server, go to iCap history, and you'll see the AV test file being sent from the Nutanix to ICAP. So since you have successfully enabled your MetaDefender ICAP to your Nutanix SMB shares, anything traversing or being read from that particular SMB share you've selected will be scanned by MetaDefender Core, and the outcome of that file will be sent back to Nutanix. In the event that file is malicious, the end user will not have access to that file. Or in the event that the file came back as benign, the user will continue to enjoy access to that file as per normal operations. I hope you have found this instruction video helpful. Thank you and have a good day.